Hello everyone, and welcome to my Emmerdale News YouTube channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribers button and give this video a thumbs up. According to Emmerdale spoilers, the most frequently asked question will soon have an answer. The secrets of the enigmatic Ella Forster are about to come to light. The newbie gets into a heated argument with someone at a funeral scene in one of the next episodes. They also demonstrate that Ella's past is more complicated than first appears. What though is she concealing? Whose funeral is she going to be attending? Scroll down to discover out. Spoilers for Emmerdale Ella Forster attends an inexplicable funeral. The mystery behind Ella Forster's past is set to be revealed, according to teasers for Emmerdale. We will eventually find out what's going on with the enigmatic visitor who is currently involved in a confrontation at a burial, in later scenes. And what do you know? Liam Kavanagh, her love interest, is also present. The cast members of the soap opera were reportedly spotted filming the funeral scenes for a woman named June Phillips. However, who is she? According to teasers for Emmerdale, Ella and Liam observe from a distance until things get heated. The subsequent scenes feature an attendee who refuses to back down, resulting in a furious altercation. Ella tries to defuse the situation, but she gets caught in the crossfire and has to deal with the enraged funeral attendee's wrath. What's the matter with their beef, though? Is June Ella's adversary or friend? Spoilers for Emmerdale readers should be aware that Ella has been viewed with mistrust ever since her arrival in Dales. From the newcomer's arrival at the vet gala to her affair with the local doctor, it's clear that she has everyone talking. In fact, many are genuinely curious. But why, exactly, is she present? With hints appearing frequently, fans are eager to learn her secrets, and the truth will eventually surface. Viewers have already connected Ella to Mina Jubla, the villain. This followed the receptionist's suspicious behavior and intense curiosity regarding the murderer, Let's investigate her possible relationship to this deceased person. Continue reading TV season and spoilers for more Emmerdale updates and spoilers. Once more, Rona Goskirk is in the driver's seat. However, what pulls her to this place? According to Emmerdale spoilers, her daughter Ivy's outcome may depend on the outcome of this court dispute. But this time, the vet has a crucial choice to make, thus her destiny is in her hands. Which will she choose, the truth or Ivy's welfare? Find out by reading on Rona Goskirk has been to court enough times lately to be found not guilty of kidnapping baby Ivy. Spoilers for Emmerdale indicate that Rona's problems are far from done even if she was declared not guilty. She will be appearing in court the following week on behalf of her daughter Ivy. Fans need to keep in mind how Rona's frozen embryos were exploited without her consent by Gus and his late wife Lucy. Gus now has to go before Rona in court for taking the eggs that originally gave rise to Ivy. However, Emmerdale spoilers claim that Gus suddenly knocks on Rona and Marlon's door prior to the trial. And what do you know? He has some really ambitious intentions for Ivy's future. He declares that regardless of what occurs, Marlon and Mary will remain in Ivy's life. However, it's clear that neither of them is buying it. After all that has transpired, why will people still believe him? Rona and Marlon have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation at home as the week goes on. Emmerdale spoilers state that the couple thanks God they have each other. They both decide that going forward, Ivy will come first in all choices. However, Rona struggles with her inner demons about how to handle the matter in her statement as the court date draws near. The veterinarian is unable to stop overanalyzing things, despite Marlon's best efforts to soothe his wife. How do you feel? Will she ultimately give her ex-husband her support? Tell us in the space provided for comments below. For now, return often to TV season and spoilers for updates and more Emmerdale spoilers. The drama on Emmerdale doesn't hold back the next week, with a wedding with a few twists and a far darker plot point in the Tom King saga's most recent development. Yes, the ITV soap opera is about to have an extremely exciting week. To help you pass the weekend till Monday, April 15, 
I've included three video preview clips of all the drama. I don't need your gratitude. While Amy Wyatt, Natalie Ann Jamison, gets ready to marry the love of her life, Maddie Barton, Ash Palmisciano, her mother Carrie, Laura Norton, is having financial difficulties. James Chase's character Tom King uses his home's puppy cam to spy on his wife, Bill Dingle, Eden Taylor Draper. When he sees her having an unexpected discussion with Vinnie Dingle, Bradley Johnson, the abuser decides to take matters into his own hands. You're in luck if you've been waiting to see a preview of the drama. Those previously mentioned videos provide just that. Have a look. Carrie asks for a miracle to help her pay for Amy and Maddie's wedding, which she has committed to paying for, as she lights a candle and prays to an invisible picture. Eric Pollard claims that the necklace the schemer was hoping would work, but it's a fake. It turns out that woman is actually praying to a photo of Cher while the camera moves around. Do you really think that? I'm sorry, but I had to. Carrie leaves to make one final attempt to raise the money. But Amy comes in to remind her mother about the impending wedding rehearsal. Mackenzie Boyd from Emmerdale worries that he won't have a job next week because Sarah Subden works at the garage. When Sarah brashly announces that she might land a permanent job at Kane Dingle's company, Mackenzie is caught off guard. Next week, when Kane's team is understaffed, he invites his granddaughter Sarah to fill in. Even though Sarah is annoyed that she was brought in at the last minute, she reluctantly starts her shift. The teenager's day at work takes a dramatic turn when a dapper customer shows up. Sparks flare between them as she fixes his car though Kane is perplexed by her sudden shift of attitude. When Sarah gets home, she tells her grandma Charity how happy she is with her work. Charity is pleased with Sarah's work, but when Sarah implies that she might take his place at the garage, Mackenzie is alarmed. Is Mackenzie's employment in danger? The actor that plays Mackenzie, Lawrence Robb, recently talked to Digital Spy on the character's future, saying, at the moment, I'm expecting it to be a little bit quieter for Mackenzie and Charity, I guess. However, since it's Emmerdale, you never know. Every character has a plan that they constantly keep changing. I'm enjoying having a little bit of a break because I've been quite full on for the last year at least. When asked if he thought there may be more illegal antics with Aaron Dingle and Mac, he said, I do enjoy working with Danny Miller, who plays Aaron. There's always laughter. When we're together on set, there's a lot of humor. Although I'm not sure right now, I hope so. I believe Mackenzie's life may now be a little bit quieter for the time being. Some of the antics that Aaron and Mackenzie get into would be entertaining to watch. Thanks for watching if you like this video. So please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any updates.